So the last British hope for today. Second year last year, second actually the year before that as well. Just going to want to make up for a disappointing race on home soil a week ago. Tani Seagrave making a bid for her first World Cup win. Stylish on the bike, Claudio. Stylish on the colours too, I like that race kit. <laughs> Tidy through there. Very nice. Yep, clean. So, and she's behind. No, she's up. Well, just, just over half a second. And also going Whoa. around that jump and, or not going around it, but going around that wooden kicker. Going a little long there, Claudio. Yeah, taking the small, the smaller jump with that speed is is quite tricky. You know, you not, you are gonna go too far. But then taking the big one, as said, and with the side wind up there is tricky as well. And you might not get over it. So the question is, which one do you choose to stay fast? Timing these uh, bumps, these jumps nicely down here, Seagrave. 2.17 a beat. This is where Nicole perhaps was a little slower along that long straight. And she was, because Seagrave now goes fastest. So she gained a second on the Stonemeyer jump. That long flat sections with all the jumps. So she obviously did it right. And Tani, she can ride the steep stuff as well. So this will be interesting. Let's see how much speed she carries yeah. through this section here. Does she have to pedal at the end? Oh, this looks good. There was, she carried great speed over the top and held her line there. Seagrave was fast. This is looking good to me. Remember. Still looking for her first World Cup win. Five times she's been second. And it's not through a lack of trying, believe me. She puts it all on the line, Seagrave. This is looking good. She's going to be quick. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, over two seconds now for Tani then. Well, her dad, Tony, will be looking on, biting his fingernails down the finish. And her brother, Chaos, actually, now starting to show what he's made of in the junior men. Fourth he got today, actually, her little brother. No more routes to go. It's just keep your brakes open now. Don't do a mistake. She'll like the big jump at the end, Tani Seagrave, the 2013 Junior World Champion, I think, is going to go fastest here in Leergang. Seagrave goes down the line, and she does by two and a half seconds. Is it going to be enough to see her take her first win? Only Tracy Hannah now left at the top.